Hey friends, this is Saxon. In this video, we are going to talk about how to take to retracts. Okay, so we have done the setup project and here is the plate which we are going to take tracks. Before start the track, first we need to analyze the plate properly. In this time, we should check the areas and markers that we are going to take to the points. In this plate, we have so many sources to take tracks. For example, here on the left corner, on this building, on this grass, etc. And keep it in mind that whenever we spread the points, we should take some points on the parallax area. If you have any doubts on the parallax, please watch my previous video. Here we can see there is a heavy parallax happening between this front hut and BG. Check it out here. After analyze the shot, next step is color correction. Color correction will give more clarity and sharpness to the plate. For color correction panel, go to window and click on image control window. There is a short key for this Alt 7. Okay, this is color correction panel. Here we have to on this image control enabled option to enable the color correction mode. After that, make sure this color contrast option also should be enabled. Below here, you can find some color values to adjust. Now I am going to adjust it. Please watch. Here I didn't adjust all the controls, only gamma, brightness and contrast. Now you can see the difference by clicking over here. See the plates look more sharp and clear. All these adjusts are depends on your plates which you take for tracking. If your plate has blur, here there is an option to adjust the blur. Just click and enable it and adjust it. We have recent button here to make this value to zero. Okay, next curve enable. This option is also used for color correction. But in this section, we can adjust the RGB value separately. Click on the view and select the color value and adjust here. See the red value are adjusting. And here this section. This option we mostly use for chroma shots that means green screen or blue screen shots with markers. I will tell you how it works. Just imagine this is a green screen and this one is a marker on it. Here I will enable this and click on the pick plus button and click on the marker. Now you can see that particular marker area got selected with black and white. This option will help you to take accurate 2D points on marker shots. That's it for color correction. Now let's start taking 2D track. For that, first go to manual tracking mode. Here only you will find the 2D tracking options. Then select the area where you are going to add a point. So I will select this area. Okay, so at the for at the point, just click on the control button and mouse left click. Here is the 2D track created. You can check here also point zero one. And here we have two boxes. These boxes are called tracking boxes. This is used for select the search area for smooth tracking. Now I'll adjust this two here. Now it's time to track it. For that you can click on this track button. Yes, it will track automatically. And here these buttons are used for frame by frame tracking. I will show you that later. The track is done, but you can see one issue. The plate is not stabilized. Without stabilize the plate, we can't check 2d track properly for that here we have an option to stabilize it center 2d click on it now you can check 
yes i think it's good as i mentioned before 2d track has two tracking boxes along with that you can find movement and uh, rotation option here and here it will mention the point name and here the point info we can off all this info by clicking on view show tracking boxes and for next here all the point info see now everything is gone okay now i will add one more point for a clarity just check okay i'll take one point over here and i'm adjusting the boxes and for this point i will go for frame by frame tracking for that click on this button or you can press greater than or lesser than key on keyboard press it yeah it's tracking okay here the fc tree is disturbing the bg point so what we will do is end this point here click here to end this point and check in this frame the point is uh, visible again now you can restart this point here for that just click over here without control button that point came back for check the current frame and the previous frame press page up and page down key just check yeah for adjusting this 2d track you can use these four keys for different angle for example 8 is moving up 6 is for side 2 for down and 4 for left side and that's it for basic 2d tracking in 3d equalizer hope you guys like this video feel free to ask any doubts on this topic please like share and subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for new updates